The free travel perk on public transport enjoyed by tens of thousands of Sydney siders on their Opal cards disappears from tonight, replaced by a more expensive deal on buses, trains and ferries, as the government closes down a loophole that's been costing it plenty of money. From tomorrow, no more free rides. Using your Opal card suddenly becomes much less rewarding. A surprise for many. I mean, this is the first I've heard of it. And I certainly didn't know about it until you mentioned it. No, okay. not at all. But transport officials say there's been plenty of warning of changes to the Opal Weekly Travel Reward System. Before now, after eight paid journeys, cardholders travelled the rest of the week free of charge. From tomorrow, that's scrapped. Instead, they'll pay half price. It'll mean a price hike for many people for up to 20%. Opal losing a little of its shine. Yeah, because it's super expensive anyways. We have already paid for eight trips now. Huh? So it's uh, every day we are paying like around 12 to 14 dollars. I'm a senior and therefore I don't think it affects me. It doesn't. Gold card holders keep the daily $2.50 cap, but for others... For those customers who are going to be paying a little bit more, they're still getting a great deal. The end of the week goes from free to something a bit more. To travel all day on the, on the rail network on a Saturday, you're paying 50% of an off-peak fare, so the maximum you pay is $5.81. To soften the blow, from tomorrow, switching transport types will no longer be penalised. So, within an hour on the same journey, commuters switching from a train to a bus will get a $2 discount. Critics say the changes will see fewer people use public transport. The government maintains it will have the reverse effect. Chris Ma, 7 News.